your journey is what a lot of people, especially young people, are like, okay, they're looking at YouTube, they're looking at entertainment, because before there was no brown faces in entertainment, mm -hmm. right? Like, you had to be in India, it was the same actors and doing comedy or movies, and you are part of this generation, this wave that was really the first YouTubers, it was you, Just Rain, Lily Singh, right? And mm -hmm. now I feel like all these young people are looking at you guys yeah. and being like, well, look how much success they've had. Yeah. I need to follow. So, but making it a career back mm -hmm. when you started, that wasn't a thing. Like no. I can't imagine anyone would be like, I'm going to make money off of YouTube. No, this we didn't is know it. That too. So what was that moment or video where you were like, you know what, this can't be just for fun. This is something I think I can do career wise. 2010 when Google contacted us, we found out that we can get paid. And you weren't getting paid up No, then. we were not wow. making money at all. 2010, we started making money. Yeah. So we were just doing for giggles yeah. and making people laugh and mm -hmm. everything. And by 2010, when we started getting paid, I was like, holy smokes, we can pay our attrition through this. Were you actually making a lot of money? Yeah, we were making a lot of money. That's like insane. Yeah. I, I, you can tell me if you want, but like your first paycheck. It was not much. I was going to say it's uh, probably like yeah. cents, right? No, like No, it was dollars. but Dollars. But not enough that you could be like, my tuition is done. No, it, could, it did help me. That's amazing yeah. from the first paycheck. Like not first paycheck. I was like, like routinely it became yeah. a big thing. And because tuition fees were not much. Like, they're like $35 a semester. Yeah. So it was, still, yeah. for you to do a couple of videos with your friends and be able to pay your tuition. Pay, pay people, yeah. kids spend their entire summers yeah. in fast food places I know. working that money. I know. So. And because the thing we started getting shows right away too. Shows, you mean live shows? Live shows. Yeah. So we started doing like comedy shows mm -hmm. or like hosting and those helped in, yeah. pushed in. So did that help your parents go? Because I, I always think even now, yeah. like it doesn't matter how progressive we've become or mm -hmm. how many generations are here. I think as South Asians, our family, their decisions really impact us, right? Yeah. We really want them to approve of our decisions. So, you know, with your parents, when did they come on board to be like, okay, we support you not being a lawyer, yeah. but to pursue this full time? Uh, back when I started, they didn't know that I was doing this. For like good two months, they were like trying to figure out why Nobody people... called them and say, we saw your son no, in a video. No, because YouTube was not big back in days. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, Nobody called them, nobody, they were like, white people are taking pictures, white people are stopping you. They were wondering, my mom was wondering a lot. Uh, we used to go to Northfields and she's like, why are these random girls are coming to you? <laughs> and she was just surprised, like, what's going on in university? But I guess uh, she, one day while she was on YouTube and uh, Facebook was like clicking in, mm -hmm. Uh, she saw one of my YouTube videos, she's like, what is this? What are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Yeah. Like, why you have a chunni on your head and yeah. everything? And I then explained everything to her. I'm like, this is what we're doing. Did she think you were funny? Or was uh, she like... No, she laughed. She oh, laughed. she did. So she, she, thought uh, she funny. laughed. Uh, she didn't have any problem with it at all since day one. She was like, as long as you're making people laugh, that's fine, you know? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. So she went along with it. Uh, what about third your dad? year, yeah. My dad was like, he's a chill guy. He, oh, okay. Yeah, he's like me. He doesn't care much. So about they were just supportive. They were like, as long yeah. as you're making people happy. As as long as you're happy. Oh, yeah. that's amazing. And third year, when I'm like, either I'm gonna uh, go to law school, mm -hmm. or I'm gonna pursue this. Mm -hmm. And that was a hard decision because I had to do my LSATs. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, let's drop that now. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. Let's see for a year. If it doesn't go through, then I'll come back to LSATs. Mm -hmm. And I finished my degree. And my career kicked off even more. I started getting movies. 